Astra is an Italian manufacturer with over 75 years of experience in producing heavy-duty off-road vehicles. In addition to developing rugged and versatile trucks, the company also specializes in customizing these vehicles to meet the specific needs of their clients. An example of such customization was the Astra BM309, which was modified to participate in the Dakar Rally. In 1985, Princess Caroline of Monaco, along with her husband and Astra, set out to compete and win in the legendary Paris-Dakar rally. To achieve this, they decided to implement a modification that would give them a significant advantage, especially in sandy terrain. This modification involved adding additional tracks to their 6x6 truck to enhance their off-road capabilities. These tracks could be deployed and retracted using a hydraulic system and were positioned on the sides of the truck, just above the rear tires. However, this modification also brought several challenges. It increased the weight of the truck by up to six tons compared to other competitors, resulting in the Detroit diesel engine not providing sufficient power. Additionally, the raised center of gravity made it more challenging to handle the truck at high speeds, especially in curves. Unfortunately, the outcome of this adventure was an unfortunate withdrawal from the competition after a crash that forced them out of the rally. Marchimobile is an Austrian company with a strong presence in the United States, dedicated to the development of luxury vehicles. Their inspiration comes from aviation, luxury yachts, and supercars, which is reflected in their series of trucks and motorhomes called Element, combining European automotive engineering with luxury and comfort. Within this series is the Element Palazzo Superior, which reaches dimensions of 13.7 meters in length and a width that, in transport mode, reaches 2.5 meters but can expand to 5 meters by extending its sides when parked. At its height of 4 meters, you'll find the driving cabin, which, aside from being elevated, features a unique design that provides an incredible panoramic view. Under its hood, there is a 600-horsepower Volvo engine capable of propelling the 28-ton weight of this vehicle. Its substantial weight is due to all the amenities it incorporates, ranging from a living room, kitchen and full bathroom, to a spa area and a rooftop terrace. In certain parts, it is constructed with materials such as carbon fiber to reduce weight, while still maintaining its robustness. Its overall structure has a thickness of over 60 millimeters, which helps achieve thermal and acoustic insulation comparable to that of extreme off-road vehicles, all without sacrificing its sleek design. Willemo was a French company whose history began with the repair of military trucks in the early 1920s, eventually becoming a renowned truck manufacturer of its time. Their specialization in custom-made trucks was evident when the internationally recognized tire manufacturer Michelin entrusted them with the production of a special truck for tire testing in 1958. Named the Willemi Michelin WR8, only a single unit was built, but it is one of the many trucks from the old school that made a mark in the transportation industry. Its distinctive design was the result of Michelin's emphasis on achieving a fast truck 
that could easily exceed 100 kilometers per hour, leading to the creation of a sloping windshield and an elongated hood inspired by aircraft aerodynamics. This design allowed them to achieve a top speed of 150 kilometers per hour, as the engine under the hood was a powerful 240 horsepower gasoline engine, which was quite impressive for that time. The cab had room for two occupants, a driver and someone monitoring tire performance data at all times. While the WR8 remained in operation for many years, covering thousands of kilometers on Michelin's test track in Ladoux, France, it was retired around the 1980s and stored in a warehouse where it deteriorated significantly. However, in 2005, it was completely restored to be showcased at events throughout Europe. Dart Truck is a company that, although it has been managed by different external companies over the years, has managed to develop some of the most reliable mining trucks of its kind, which are still used and deployed in various heavy-duty industrial sectors. This is the case with their Dart 5000 truck, a unique vehicle that, despite originally being a mining truck, has been adapted for various hauling tasks, ranging from transporting minerals to carrying enormous water tanks. One of its notable configurations is as a bottom dump hauler for salt transportation. To accomplish this work, it harnesses the power of its 1,200 horsepower engine and 5,100 newton meters of torque provided by its Cummins engine and Allison transmission. It can transport loads ranging from 120 to 450 tons of salt by coupling different trailer configurations. On its own, the Dart measures 10 meters in length, 6.5 meters in width, and 5 meters in height, making it visually impressive. Its capabilities have made it the most efficient option for some of the largest salt flats in the world, such as the one located in Baja, California, Sur, Mexico. This salt flat exports to countries like Korea, Taiwan, and New Zealand, and covers an area of over 30,000 hectares since it is situated on an ancient seabed where solar radiation alone filters the salt. Cress is an American company specialized in the development of haulers for the materials handling industry, particularly minerals and metals. Their focus is on providing reliable, rugged, and high-capacity solutions. Among their notable equipment is the Cress 200C3 Coal Hauler. This truck is constructed with high-performance steel, giving it exceptional resistance to abrasion and ensuring a long service life. Although its appearance may resemble that of a typical bottom dump trailer, it is a powerful machine equipped with a 2,100 horsepower CAT engine. This not only ensures optimal performance, but also allows the unit to be serviced and supported by Caterpillar's extensive distribution network. The body of this truck is robust yet lightweight, and it boasts an impressive payload capacity of 228 cubic meters, enabling it to transport up to 240 tons of coal. In addition to its rugged design, one of its standout features is its steering system. With dual tires on all four axles, it improves stability and the distribution of pressure on the ground. Furthermore, it offers an 85-degree steering angle, providing unmatched maneuverability. The Cress 200 C3 Coal Hauler is a reliable and efficient option for transporting heavy loads in the mining industry. Its sturdy construction, powerful engine, and excellent payload capacity make it an indispensable tool for materials handling in demanding environments such as open pit mines. Thank you so much for sticking around until the end of the video. We hope you enjoyed it and found it valuable. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any of our upcoming videos. We can't wait to see you in the next one.